negative imaginary impedance on the y-axis and the real impedance on the x-axis. Why would anybody do impedance in the first place? DC voltammetry is like listening to the music. More combinations like Randall's elements and then series, resistors, capacitors, and constant phase elements. We convert from polar coordinates to Cartesian coordinates. The value of this inductor is often meaningless. This is all a lot of terminology and jargon for the same thing, which is a potential stat. For the most part, I don't think anybody really knows why it happens. 